Well, good morning, chums. It's a cup of tea with Captain Steve episode. Heck, yes, it is. But you know what? This is going to be similar to what I did with Mutual Maker the other day, where I'm just going to play the game and I'm going to be quiet. No narration. I'm going to let you see what Arcade Paradise is like to play without me talking all over it. So let's get into this, shall we, people? I might pop up every now and again just to let you know what's going on. But I'll see you in a moment. Audacious! Thank you. 
fights!
I approved your proposal to convert the utility room and extend the King Laundry trading area. More space, more washing machines. It's a little obvious, but fine. Hopefully by now you appreciate Laundry's vital role in the community, and the modest but steady income it provides. Reinvestment is a sure path to success. Maybe this is your first step to owning your own business empire. Perhaps someday you'll rise to my rank. Gerald, king of the Riviera. <laughs> Continue. Winner! Audacious!
Hello again people, it's me. Yeah, so now I'm just putting money into the actual safe and I'm hoping to use that money to buy some arcade machines. Now I have gone and invested in the DLC for this game and one of the DLC cabinets is Kong Fury. I love the movie Kong Fury. If you've never seen the movie Kong Fury, I'll put a link in the top right hand corner. Check it out, full movie by the way.
So I'm hoping this has given you more of an idea of what this game is like, because normally I speed up all the sort of repetitive bits. But yes, the, re re the repetition though is still gamified. And I actually find this a very relaxing and fun game to play at times. So yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. And if you see it in a sale or something like that, and it appeals to you, I would highly recommend it. It's good fun. And it's got that retro-esque vibe to it. It's pretty darn cool. Well, I'm, I'm not a fan of the Confury game. It's a little bit weird. It's not like Streets of Rage. It's not like how it looks. No, it's just press left and right to do attacks. And then uh, yeah, I got to press it quite a lot of times. And there's no, well, there is skill. Because as you can see, I freaking died within the first level. But yeah, not my cup of tea.
But I do like this game. This game's freaking awesome. Like a little mini Olympics game. Freaking awesome. I used to love one on the SNES, but it was Tiny Toons Olympics. I can't remember the exact name of it, but it was awesome. It really was great fun.
So there we go, people. That's pretty much Arcade Paradise. You see me do two or three days there, and I've got a couple of new arcade machines, expanded my arcade. It's a great little game. Will I be bringing more episodes to the actual channel? Yes, but after I've built the arcade up quite a lot, and you can start to see me replacing the washing machines. But for now, I think I've given you enough of this game to give you a sort of taste of it. I might do a review in future. Coming up, though, is a trophy that I managed to get, then I'm ending off. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again, people in the view of us. Cheery bye. But steady income it provides. Reinvestment is a sure path to success. Maybe this is your first step to owning your own business empire. Perhaps someday you'll be. Well, thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit a like and a subscribe. And I'd like to say a massive great big thank you to all of my backers over on Patreon and over on YouTube membership. Thanking you, backers. And if you want to support this channel, just don't skip the adverts. That throws revenue down my avenue. Or yeah, just stay with Captain Steve that little bit longer and hit something on this screen. There's merch here now too.